So you'll see here that I'm doing a repour um, on a canvas that um, of a painting I, I didn't really like. I am doing a split canvas um, with white and the colors on the left and black on the colors on the right. This is my first time attempting this split um, canvas like this. Uh, I thought that it would kind of be a cool effect to have the um, contrast in there. And you'll see I just kind of alternate between each color. You know, I use the white or the black in between each of the, the colors. This kind of helps those colors stay separated um, in the puddle pour. And um, I'll, I'll mark down the colors that I used in the brand, which the white and the black are Artist Loft, and the colors are Americana. Together, these two different brands um, for the puddle pours do really, really well. Um, I really like the effects that we get out of that, and um, I really enjoy doing the puddle pours. They're they're my favorite. Um, I have tried doing the dirty pour or the flip cup, and I mean they're really fun to do also. And you get a lot of really different um, effects from those different types um, of pours. But I I, I gotta say that this is generally my favorite type of pour and um, so here I'm just gonna I'll be finishing up and then you'll see um, to right before you start moving the paint around the canvas um, you'll see me put my fingers through it here and that kind of helps blend you know the colors together and kind of helps to create those effects that you get afterwards. And um, so it was really difficult to keep those. Um, I really wanted to keep those sides separate. So it was really kind of tricky to move it and cover the whole canvas and not, you know, um, and keep to be able to keep that contrast in there. Um, I think it turned out pretty well um, for my first time. I think it was... I had fun making it. It was it was a fun little experiment, and I really really liked the way the painting turned out. Um, so you'll see here, um, just gradually the effects just kind of start popping up. You can see little cells start here and there. Um, on that left side, you can see it a lot better than on the right side so far. And so um, here in a second, it's going to show the final result which, you know, is quite different from what you see here. Um, so I, I just, I love to watch, you know, the change. It's, it's really interesting. And so here is the final um, result, and you can see how much it's changed. Um, there's a little more orange and less red than I wanted, but overall it really did turn out good. There's some really cool effects in there. And um, I'll definitely be trying, you know, the split canvas again, just to maybe with some lighter, brighter colors. But I hope y'all enjoy watching this video and hope it'll give you some good ideas. And, um, and I'll see you on the next video.